no, we had an extra little set through. With this composition that the Leviathans have drafted for themselves, uh, I think Yolio that's the reason we're starting to see this out. I'm well aware, but they make me think of different style of beats. The Panatom's ganking the solo lane. Scared, he's low. One more auto. That's all. At the moment, we could be seeing a resurgence. Another gank, if possible. Yeah, with pulled that. in by the Atlas. And uh, yeah, just a couple of hits. Yeah, once I... The map, though, still getting bullied. Thor's here now, and he's going to change things around. The wall is good, and the damage is there. Defensively in the jungle, rooted out by Inbound. Bound. And the slows aren't going to work. The tethers only doing so much. The formation from Wrong Yu. Leap forward. There's the blink from Panatom. They throw the sickle. They get the damage. And they kill off the cave. Then it can deal. Feels the level get dropped. But the Leviathans will put it was here. Baronic, scary. Forced under the tier two. The CC is there. Oh, and they lock. Old Fear to look good. Zap wants a fight. Gets knocked up. The autos are there. Inbounds come to save. Thor is here too. But Wrong Yu's joined the fray. Zap's still going to fall from the hammer from Sam. Now the jousting lot is thrown down, and the damage is there. Shinto dodges some in the wall, but is not able to escape. Find the laser. Oh, too late. <laughs> Zap's rotated in. They're going to pick up the fight. It's going to be inbound. Who's the target? He scares Blessings himself. The apple from the disco comes out. Hits Shinto. Aegis used, and the damage dodge. It's going to be a split fight chasing down Stuart. They find the pop, and Zap gets himself too. But then a double stun from Sam. Double dunk helps. It's not going to kill you. It's going to be on to inbound. Inbound gets some damage out there. There's the lockdown. Luckily, some health. Maybe a little bit of healing. Shito gets dunked down on there. Four. Two guardians, incredibly difficult to take down. Meanwhile, Panatom, look for the kill on the inbound. Stun is good. They're trying to find the CC. Pull back from hardcore, and then a brilliant heart bomb finds damage, and the chase down. Panatom is able to get Stuart. Now, Baronic just trying to stay alive, but unfortunately, those beads. It's zoned out by hardcore. Or should see this, can't do anything about it. What damn, looking for the dunk, finds it on Zap. Zap gets the Aegis, Zap gets the bees, Zap gets the kill, and they're looking for more. They take down two scarabs in the blink of an eye, and they're turning the fight around. They kill off inbound, they're chasing down Baronic, and they're looking for the full on deicide. It's just the question of if Stuart can get out of here. In the meantime, they get themselves a Pyromancer, and they're looking to run down mid lane. Fine. Not because of how much CC they'll be able to save his team, really kind of keep the Solar Scarabs alive throughout the early game, but once we get down, it's more than like a point. No it's a lot going in towards mid, and you called it, Myth Morgan. Five in. There could be some chase down here. Yeah, this is a good assault so far. There's going to be the double joust. Oh. Crazy different now, though. Do you want the fight in mid? Veronica is the target. And look at the damage from Panatom. Wrong you. Bills is going to be able to pull two people in on that, but now has to get out of here. Minions doing oh, their work. Oh, no, it. the heart bomb. Sam uses the ult to get out of there. Panatom's rotated in, looking for the damage. Goes for the ult and is immediately on Stuart. One more auto, gets the kill, and now turns for Sam Root. Just shy oh, from Wrong is. you, but it does. Placed. Oh, that Zap, egregious. no is big. Zap's going to drop the Sanctified Fields, just trying to stay alive. It actually might help him out. Sam's off the horse. CC what? minute, he's gone. He's going to turn one around. He might die, but it takes the Sam treatment on the other side of the map. No Sanctified Fields to his name. Beads, Egg is used. He's getting good damage, though. Oh, oh, no, might be stuck in a fight. Knock up from Harcore onto Baronic, and they're going in for it. Transforms into the Cthulhu, uses the ult, but Harcore is chasing him down, and Shinto joins the fray to get the kill. Now the chase is on. Great save from Rongyu onto Panaton, but it might not be enough to keep him alive the second time, but it doesn't even matter because it's a double kill for Shinto. It's a single kill here for Harcore, and Scary D gets taken down by Zap. It's a four for one. He has much to worry about. Might not be the place he wants to go, though. He dashes back onto the map. And that in never decided to get aggressive. They did fight Scarabs and didn't pay them any mind. Either way, the Scarabs now going to try to make up for that, getting aggressive and trying to go on to Zap. They lock him down and they get the kill. Unfortunately for Wrong Yu, Scarabs blessing onto himself, but it doesn't matter because the kills, they're swinging the other way around. Stuart, last man standing. It's a triple kill for Shinto. Stuart finds some damage back. Make sure that it's not a full force. Just farming throughout this game. Decides the quad for Shinto to the SCC teams out there. And definitely a much needed win for the Leviathans. Absolutely mind-blowing run that the J-Dragons have had this week.